please advise. I'm not responsible for any injuries or damage that has occurred. Don't complain to me that you've broken a vase or something. And I do understand that the video is a little blurry, but it's visible. Anyway, please subscribe and enjoy the video. Thank you. Hey everyone, today we're going to be making three normal rubber bands into this machine of death. Let's see how we can do that. Alright, so how we're going to do that is very simple. As you see, it's pretty much tied together. But of course, this is no knot that's really hard to make. You can undo it, but it might take you a while. It's essentially put these rubber bands together and how we're going to do that is we're going to grab this rubber band the longest one this the one that stretches the most um, which is I think this one stretches the longest and we're going to essentially if I remember correctly we bring it through and we wrap the rubber band around it's original like that as you see it comes together and it won't tear apart while you're trying to throw it now grab your other one I'll do this a lot slower so you guys understand grab the rubber band that you want to be that you want this thumb to fold back and then essentially put this one over the middle rubber band push it through the hole just like this so it should look like overlapped like that grab the hole in the middle and then pull it tightly whoops guys this one's being really annoying I'll get back to you guys when I have this finished so there we go all you have to do is pull it through but yeah all you have to do is I have another set of rubber bands here all you have to do is essentially push it through like that put it over and then push it through and then pull whoops guys the struggle is super real here there we go, and then push it through until it's tight. Let's see how far this thing really goes. Alright, so from behind the camera, all you do is put your thumb, the very end, of, like the tip of your thumb here, pull as far back as you can until it's tight, and then release this thumb first, causing it to launch. Just like a normal rubber band, but a lot harder. So here we go. Bruno, shut up. You know, try to hit the rubber, the uh, dot. Three, two, one, go. Oh, wow, I totally missed that. It doesn't even hurt your finger, too. It's pretty awesome. It's not like one rubber band, but might just skin your. Go. I don't know. I'm really bad at aiming. Um, but yeah, as you see, it goes fairly far. It did hit near the watermelon right here, but I think I'm going to be stacking some happy. Okay. Alright, let's see if we can hit the apple off of the other apple. And I bet, I wonder if we can actually put these two together. I just realized that we probably could. Let's see if we can here. Alright, I just realized we can't because it's too, it'll be too uh, easy to break. Let's try again. Oh, the apple fell. Let's try to get my dog under control. We're going to try over here. Not a good shot. I don't know. Okay, I really got my finger in there. So, we may not be able to do the apples. But, I think you guys get the point that this is a very high powered rubber band here. And you could probably attach way more and have like, you hold on to this end and then have a friend pull all the way back and pull the other and launch it and now it hurts so bad. 
So anyway, guys, thank you all for watching. Create the server band destro uh, destroyer and annoy some people with it. And I will see you guys in the next video. I'm going to be starting watching some of that Looney Tunes. See you later.